It's unlike anything this sport has ever seen. Young horses being developed without jockeys on a machine designed by engineers from the roller coaster industry. But this is no amusement park ride. In the horse racing heartland of Lambourne, it's a 20 million pound, 1.5 kilometer undercover track, capable of taking 10 horses at a time, from walking pace right up to a gallop, around 30 miles an hour. Its aim by removing jockeys is to remove human error from early training of young racehorses. Mistakes can be costly, but they expect this facility will increase the odds of horses reaching the racetrack. A lot of young horses have injuries in the beginning of the training because they are not ready to uh, start the, the, the real training. Such cutting edge technology has unsurprisingly caught the attention of the racing industry who were keen to set eyes on it for the first time. It's an amazing thing to come and see, you know, I never thought that I'd see something like this in my lifetime. And like, you know, to train a racehorse or, or to be successful in any sport, it's all about trying to find that repetition that makes you successful. And whether this works, we'll have to wait and see. In the sport of kings, nothing comes cheap. Taking these prized horses out of the paddock and tethering them to a 17-ton machine carries risks. A senior horse vet from the Royal Veterinary College has endorsed the system, giving its welfare aspects to date the thumbs up. It's key to the owners that the animal's well-being comes first. We have a very soft approach with the machinery and uh, we teach there to come in confidence uh, day by day. Its success will ultimately be measured by its ability through a monitored and controlled environment to improve the welfare of young horses. If more make it into racing than do now, then this extraordinary machine will be seen as the start of a revolution. Rupert Evelyn, News at 10, Berkshire.